Let me tell you about Bob Salway. So when I finished my private, I really wanted to find a middle-aged guy who was a career instructor. So I found this guy at another school. And we started flying together. Now I did my private on Cherokees. They don't need a lot of rudder input on landing, at least the ones I flew. And so I'm in a 172 and needed a little bit more input and I was struggling. So he says, why don't you do some tail dragger time on the school's Cetabria? You don't have to, but I think you would really learn a lot and it would really get your feet more active. So I trusted him and he was right. And not only that, it just, everything clicked for me. You know, my speed on final, my landings were straight. And I also fell in love with tail draggers. So I have always felt really grateful to this guy. Last night, I'm putting together the slides for my new course, Run Up, how to prepare to fly commercially right out of flight school. And I'm going through some old pictures and there's pictures of me and Bob in the tail dragger. Well, who do I hear on the radio today? Bob, still teaching. So I got on the radio, talked to him, said thank you for all the tail dragger time. And I could tell he was touched because he's a career instructor. This is what he does. So why am I telling you this? Two reasons. One, if you're gonna go into instructing, and again, you don't have to, do it for the right reasons. Do not do it to build time. You'll be the worst instructor. I hate guys like you because I flew with people like you and you were the worst. You wasted my time and you wasted my money. But if you enjoy teaching, if you enjoy sharing aviation, then absolutely do it because it's such an important job for the industry. We need people like you. And for all you people who are flying commercially and you had one of those instructors, drop them a line, say thank you. I'm telling you, it'll make their day. To those, if you had one of those instructors that opened up aviation to you, go and say thank you. Take care, everybody.